Hey everybody and welcome to my channel. This channel is all about hair loss, fighting your hair loss naturally and regrow your hair naturally. It works, it can be done. This was me a few years, years ago and I could finally treat my hair loss naturally. I'm only using natural treatments, no minoxidil, no phenasteride, just natural ingredients, natural treatments. If you want to learn more, subscribe to my channel. I will share all the information with you. So subscribe, thumbs up, yeah. So today we are talking about David Beckham and especially about the hair of David Beckham. I mean, I don't know if you were following it, but there have been lots of rumors during the summer, especially the Sun, um, the British Sun wrote, I mean, four or five articles about the hair of David Beckham actually and they were asking if he had a hair transplant, if he wears a hair piece, if he is using hair topic concealer or hair fibers, I don't know. And they, are all, all, they already wrote an article in September that his fans are really um, worried about his hair situation and they posted a picture of David um, being in a pool and you can really see his that his hair on top is really really thin. So I want to do a review about his hair. I want to tell you my honest opinion about his hair and I want to tell you what I would do if I was David Beckham. So let's have a look at all the articles. Article number one is an article from September 8th and the Sun says that fans of David Beckham are really worried about his, his hair situation and they also post a picture of David being in the pool, relaxing in the pool and you can really see that his hair on top is thinning heavily. I mean, you could, you could already see it in the past years but since David Let's switch to another picture. Since David was wearing this hairstyle for the last few years, I mean, th that's a perfect hairstyle to cover your hair loss, actually. I mean, um, whether it's a hair piece or some, some, some magic done by his, I don't know, his stylist, um, but it's a very good hairstyle actually to cover your hair loss. I mean, the picture on the left is maybe four or five years old. And when I saw this in the media, I already thought that he is really thinning on top. So I was always wondering how he's actually doing this on the right. So maybe it's a hair piece, which I think it is, or it's just um, there is some fill up in the in the hair behind his hairline and he just throws the longer hair from the from the front over this um, volume patch I don't know how to call it actually but I mean there are quite a lot of pictures where you can really see that he is thinning heavily on top and so the Sun also suspected that he had uh, maybe a hair transplant which was in on August 24th so I mean the thing that's really interesting is that one week he is having this kind of hairstyle which is where you can see that his hair is really dark especially compared to this area, so the one, the area on top is really dark, I would say dark brown and um, it's really thick and not thin and then a few weeks later you can see something like this and what I suspect and you can also see it on the wedding of Prince Harry actually, I mean there was one picture that's really obviously for me that he's using some kind of hair powder, concealer or something like that because you can really see that his hair has this powder effect on top. I mean here is his natural hair 
and there is this magic powder in my opinion that his stylist used to thicken up his hair and to cover his hairline and I mean we, we already we all know how good this powder works if you have just thinning hair and the interesting thing about it is that his hair loss pattern is very similar to mine I mean I don't have a bald patch actually I have some thinning on top which is very similar to David and yeah so I think this is uh, I don't think it's a hair transplant actually because um, I mean it could be because he's wearing a lot of hats so it's it's really good for him to if he would have had a hair transplant it would be very easy for him to hide it until until the end result so but I don't think this has been a hair transplant actually it's uh, I would I would say it's a concealer or maybe a hair piece or or a combination of both but I don't think it's a hair transplant but if I was David Beckham I would really I don't know I mean he has of course contact to the best hair transplant clinics and doctors in the world I mean that's no problem for him I mean he also has contact to the best best doctors in the world who will have told him about minoxidil minoxidil and finasteride so I'm not worried about it but in his case I mean I would say that he is the perfect candidate to fight his hair loss naturally in fact so because his hair needs a lot of vitamins his hair needs power I mean it's not a typical hair loss pattern when you say um, take finasteride and everything is good he is the perfect guy for fighting his hair loss naturally if I have a look at his hair loss pattern so if I was David Beckham I would do I would really go for some supplements I would work out a hair loss strategy because that's what he actually needs in this situation and I'm sure if he has someone to advise him how to fight his hair loss I mean he would not have a hair like in his 20s before but he could really fill out up this uh, thinning patches and he could at least grow back a good density just using natural treatments so please tell me in the comments below what do you think about his hair what do you think about David fighting his hair loss naturally maybe or what do you think is he wearing a hairpiece did he have a hair transplant maybe you also have some good pictures where we can analyze his hair a little more or do you maybe think he's just using some hair topic or concealer what do you think just let me know post it into the comments subscribe my channel give me a thumb up if you want more VIP hair loss reviews or hair reviews we can also do a review of some people or some VIPs that have actually very good hair just post some names just leave me a comment and subscribe to my channel see you soon bye your Mike